And thanks for staying with us at 5:30 as Fox 61 continues to celebrate Black History Month. This week, race and culture reporter Raquel Harrington gives us a look at different Black-owned restaurants across the state. She joins us live in studio with a look at her first stop. Raquel, yes, I'm pretty excited about this. You see, the Hartford staple, the Russell, has opened a new location in West Hartford, and that's where today's CT culture takes us as we catch up with owners on how he's working to continue creating a cultural experience for all to enjoy. Since 2005, owner Hugh Russell says his restaurant vision has never wavered. Wanted to bring some real Caribbean flavor into the community. That flavor is not only authentic, but at the Russell, it's in everything. We're talking cocktails to the Caribbean cuisine. The food is amazing. The oxtail, the fried chicken, the jerk wings, the bami fries, the ackee, of course. I'm here and you have a meal you're going to remember that spice that lingers in the back of your of your palate. But as Russell explains, that flavor doesn't stop at your appetite. It goes into the atmosphere. It's always a place where people meet, where people gather, where relationships are made, where conversations are held. And so for them, it's home away from home. And for more than 15 years, it's that comfort and hospitality that keeps folks coming back. A lot of people are not exposed to our culture. So this is like bringing them home, bringing them home away from home. Also for people who are not able to go back that often, just have the authentic food and vibes here is very important. This is why he says they've been able to expand and open this location in the midst of a pandemic. I survived because of the support that the community has given me. And the support is not because we're a great restaurant, but also because we create an, an amazing experience. It's a Caribbean experience that started with a vision through food, cocktails, and good vibes. All right, so the Russell New West Hartford location is open, and it just opened a few weeks ago, actually. Now we have more information and that address posted on Fox61.com and the Fox61 News app. For CT Cultured, Raquel Harrington, Fox61 News.